And that was just a smooth move. Kawhi with a nice touch. Little jump hook through the lane. Five-point lead, and Barnes right back at you. And that's the 1B, right? And Nick Nurse talked about it all the time. Like, hey, he was the second option, and then you back that up with a mark. Gasol, and of course, as Siakam gets the bucket. Good shooting three-point team like the Clippers. You have to secure the rebound. Do not give them second opportunities. Flynn, good job getting into the paint and a 7-0 run. Raptors down by one. The feed back to Pascal. A good look over top because of the size. Thaddeus Young checking in for the first time. George. And Flynn comes away with the steal. Here's Pascal over to OG, rising up. The three! Bucket and book it. And they're coming back and winning four straight games. The Bucks could not adjust to what the Raptors were doing. Siakam on the catch and then lays it up and in. Good pass over the top by Fred. Seven a point lead. Largest lead of the night. OG, great defense. Kawhi's shot doesn't go. Lead growing. And that's what happens. You can't allow. Nice look right here. Scotty Barnes finding a Pascal Siakam with a smaller Reggie Jackson on him. Reggie Jackson at 36%. And Pascal counted into foul. And that's exactly what it was. That is Young couldn't really help on the weak side on that back cut because there's a shooter in the corner. Pascal, a great attack. And it's a 15-point game. Pascal. Being very aggressive, I'm sorry. That's a contact, and Siakam just worked his way through it. Last time he was in this building, he was wearing Raptor red, Norm. With the steal, Norm taking it, and a good job by Pascal at the very end. I think that's going to be the biggest part for the Clippers. How does Paul George and Kawhi Leonard complement each other? And so far in the games that they played together, that has happened, right? Due to the Clippers, with the Clippers did to the Pistons yesterday. 